me and says, you will never truly realize what you don't know until you allow yourself to know. Wow. <clears throat> and, and what, how, that, how I accepted that was, sometimes we just shut ourselves off to things instead of opening up our minds, our hearts, and our spirits to take it. Recently, um, Houston had, I think it was Houston, had major flooding. And when it, the major reason why it was so bad is because the ground had went so long without rain that it almost became like a break. So when it rained, it wouldn't absorb it. Yeah. yeah. Sometimes we allow our brain to become wow. a brick. Come on. Instead of a sponge. Wow. That's pretty cool. I don't care how old, how young you are. That's good. That's young kids That's good. with your parents, always be a sponge. Even if you don't understand it, a lot of times you're not old enough to understand it. But let's get in the habit of being a sponge instead of a brick. Um, a lieutenant of mine, when I first came on the department, he had been on like 35 years. One day he told me, he said, cool. He said, I don't know what you do know, but I do know what you don't know. If you be quiet, pay attention, you just might learn something. Come on. Hey, hey.